Can we just take a moment to just bask in the beauty of this right now? Just taking a moment, taking a moment right now. I am so stoked and excited to talk to you about this that I had to have green tea because I can't have caffeine right now because this was such a great sale for me. So I'm drinking my green tea. We're going to talk about this clearance sale that started today, Friday, June 12th. It's going to end Sunday, June 14th. And I'm going to tell you how you guys can hit these deals up, get all this, or at least something, but super cheap. I'm going to tell you what I got in overages. I'm going to show you what I got for my deals, what worked, what didn't work. Just drinking that green tea, y'all. Just drinking that green tea. I'm, I'm literally, I literally feel like I bodied this thing. I probably could have bodied it some more. I'm just going to say, I could have bodied all of this a little bit more, a little bit harder. But as Jesus said, do not store your treasures here on earth, but put them in your heavenly kingdom. And I was like, but Jesus, I still got to get a few things. Still got to get a few things. So I left a lot of stuff behind, but <laughs> left a lot of stuff behind, but still got a lot of good stuff. Can I get an amen? I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Yes, Lisa, yes. I'm just telling you guys. I'm so excited to tell you all these good deals. It's been a long time since I've gotten such a good deal like this anyways. And I think with quarantine, this just made me even more hype. So I'm going to go ahead and turn my camera around and talk to you guys. If you've got any questions, put them on here. I'll try to answer them as best as possible. I know my husband's going to be rolling in here any minute from the gym. <gasps> Library Baby was with me too. And I think uh, Donuts helped... Uh, you know, convincing her to be good. So, all right. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all the things I got today, tell you the prices and everything. I did do three different transactions on this deal. So a lot of this, you'll see kind of how I did my different transactions to really um, maximize my savings. And reason being is a lot of times some of these digitals or paper coupons, you can't use multiples within the same transaction because of um, the limitations upon the paper coupons or digitals. Here she is. She was my big helper today. Oh, leave. Oh. That is. We got that for dad. That was a hats bomb. Happy birthday. <laughs> She really liked it. So we got everything here today, though, for $27. That's 73 items. We got them for $0.36 cents per item. There was a few items I had to, like, buy to bribe the kid over here. But we're going to go through each one step-by-step step here for you all, uh, for you to enjoy it. This was not a sale item. This is just something I had to buy to keep her happy. So go take that. You want to go take that in the living room? No? Go take that in the living room. You know, play with that. All right, so... Uh, let's go ahead and see the all free and clear items here. Let's see. Let me try to find where they're at on here. I'll just go by receipts. How about that? So right here, the Crest items, the Crest Complete, these are currently 81 cents. We have a $1 digital. So check your accounts. Um, and by the way, when I went into the store, there was a lot of different places where a lot of the clearance items were sitting at. Uh, because remember, they're not doing bins this year or right now because of the whole COVID-19. They want to have everything as much as possible out on shelves. So really look around, walk around. Um, I saw some on in caps and then I was walking down. You know how Dollar General has like this big main middle aisle. All of a sudden, all this stuff was there. So I was very excited. So this was, it rang up for me and, and BTW before I start anything. My store was 70% off, not 50% off. So most people are probably going to be maybe 50% off. Hopefully you're 70% off, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you the prices because they're still really great deals. So just just uh, keep that in mind that my store was 70% off. So this rang up as 81 cents for me. The $1 digital did come off. So that was overage right there. So that's what, 80, 90, like 19 cents overage. So I said, yes, please. And I did three different transactions, so you know I used my 19 cents overage on other items. This was a little conundrum. It was really weird. I wonder if I look back at the paper coupon some more. Maybe it's the baking soda thing. I don't know. It didn't have limitations upon that, but it just basically said you couldn't use it for anything under like 2.7 ounces. And these have two tubes on them, right? 
Oh, let me show you the UPC code for this. I'm so sorry. I know a lot of people will be like, let us see the UPC codes for that, and then I don't show it. All right. Uh, so here's the Colgate item. It was a double pack. Baking soda peroxide whitening. Here's the code for it. For my friends out there. Um, and I used a 50 cent paper coupon that was in the, oh gosh, I think it was the 531 Retail Me Not. Um, you can look on coupontom.com to see where these exact coupons came from. That's C-O-U-P-O-N-T-O-M.com. Just type in Colgate and it should tell you exactly where it's at. Uh, let's see, I used them all on different transactions. Okay, so these were 81 cents and I had a 50 cent paper coupon. So it was 50, 60, 70, 30 cents for two of them, basically. 30 cents for two of them, so that's really great. Oh, well, thank you, Melissa. Girl, she said, girl, your face is looking slim and trim. I don't know what you're doing, but I see. Thank you, Miss Melissa Jones. And yes, I am actually losing weight and trying to, so that's nice that other people yeah. notice. <laughs> Yes, I am trying, and I will be posting a video about that as well, what I'm doing, because I'm currently doing the Chloe Ting Challenge. Everybody check her out. She is phenomenal. She is super sweet and adorable, and her program is for free online on YouTube, and I also do, it like, different nutrition stuff, so, yeah. Um, the Listerine bottles, I couldn't pass these batteries up. These are huge. They're just huge. And the sale price before everything went off anyways was $5.95, but the sale price when I got them was $1.78. I am fine with paying $1.78 for this with no coupons. I am absolutely okay with that. Um, here it is up close for you guys. Sorry my lighting keeps going in and out. I'm not sure why it does that, uh, but when I get up close, you guys can see everything. Make sure you screenshot these things whenever, especially I'm done um, with the video and it uploads. That will help you when you go into the store. Uh, let's see. The Kotex. These were really awesome. These are $2.02. There's a lot of you buy Kotex ones, but these were the ones I um, prefer because I like to have regular and super, but there was also ones that just had the regular. Um, and I believe the liners, the digital, I don't think attaches to the liners because it does exclude that product. So I got obviously the tampons instead. This is the 34 count with the regular and the super. And again, you can get it with just the regular and they do attach to the regular as well. But this is what I got. Um, here's the UPC code. These were, uh, $2 and two cents. And my uh, coupon, my digital coupon, my $2 digital coupon attached, making these two Daddy cents. That's mom nuts. Mom. That's nuts. Hey, make sure you put that back. That's Frank Katie. Okay. That's mine. Mommy got you all stuff today, kid. Don't open that up. There's a new baby coming in our family, so I wanted to get a lot of baby stuff t uh, while I was there. All right, so the next thing we have on here is the Febreze plug. Um, I have a lot of Febreze things at home. Uh, this was kind of lucky that I found this. This was actually a penny. Don't forget to try to scan things for penny items, guys. I probably would have sat and scanned a lot more, but I had the library baby with me. And you guys know when you got a toddler, um, the fact that I spent maybe 30, 40, min 40 minutes in there anyways and got all this, I am happy with that with her. So this was a penny. So make sure you, because um, I did find qu a couple pennies. So... Just really scan your items when you get on your Dollar General app, the very home page, when you get on the home page, not when you're in your coupons part, but in the home page, there, at the top right, there is a UPC little barcode, just a little bar scanning thing that looks like this, and you can just scan away, right? And that's really awesome. Hold on, let me answer this person on here. Somebody sent me a message from work, and that actually warrants answering okay so there's that so this was a penny item yay happy about that uh next item on this one the scrubs the scrubs right here these are really awesome we use these at work um all the time i probably need to let my cleaning girl know to get these because she's a couponer too <laughs> but these scrubbing bubbles were in my regular clearance aisle and this <laughs> she said what dad what these were like, um, gosh, let me find it on here. 54 cents. I had a 50 cent paper coupon. Um, again, I can't tell you off the top of my head where it was. I know it was on my clearance video, but these were four cents each. 
So yay! Four cents each. You can't beat that with a stick. And then let's see. We also got an Airwick warmer. I was these were I was very excited. Um, I had to get I believe two of them to each one because we had a digital actually with these, but you have to buy two of them. They were ninety cents each, and we had a dollar for two uh, digital coupon. So again, they were a dollar for two digital coupon. These were ninety cents each. So we basically paid, gosh, my math is off. Can't even remember. But you know, you know the deals if you're like smarter than me. Somebody can post the number there. But I said, that's a really great deal for two of them. So that was awesome right there. But you do have to pick up two of these. You got to find two of them. Um, and then this one, I was super excited about this. If I can find this on here, I hope I find it. I don't, I don't think it's on this particular... It's not on this receipt so let me come back to this one because that was a super good one too but that's not on this receipt you guys know i did three different transactions so uh oh okay so here's another one with the digitals if you have digitals or paper coupons you're going to kill with some overage with these look for covergirl products you're going to body it for sure with a lot of overage with these this um covergirl mascara peacock one is a dollar 80. we have a three dollar i digital for covergirl there's also $3 uh, paper coupons. I think they're from the 531 as well. I could be totally wrong. Oops, sorry. About dropped my camera here. Um, just, again, check on coupontom.com. If you're a person like me that doesn't know exactly what's in all of your coupons, you can just quickly reference that and then go, oh, okay, I know where these are at. And then find your coupons and then go to the store. So these were, again, $1.80, and we had a $3 digital, making that, oh, gosh, a dollar twenty in overage and when we say overage that means you can use that extra dollar twenty on all your other things in your cart can I help you yeah that means you can use it in your cart on other things there you go and then you know you can use that money on other things in there uh, so that was one of those I got two on each one because what I did was I used my digital up and then I used a paper coupon that's why I've got like six of these different ones. This one I think was a different price versus those. Yeah, this was the CoverGirl Caddy Cat Eye. This one was $1.57, so it was a little bit cheaper. And again, the $3 digital and paper coupons worked. They went through just fine. No problems, no beeps, no nothing. Um, so that was another overage. That was like almost $1.50 in overage. That's awesome. Uh, next one I have here is the Lysol sprays. I saw these, you know, we live in those times, so we all about that, which my husband always likes Lysol anyways, and we spray everything down when people get sick or whatever, so we like these things. This was $1.35, no coupons here, but I was happy about it. I believe there's still a, a Lysol deal, though, going on that's a store deal. It's save $2 when you buy 10 in Lysol products, so if you had enough Lysol products, then you could at least get some money off that way through instant savings. I could be wrong about that instant saving, so somebody can correct me if I'm wrong. It's totally fine. Um, good morning, Amara. Good morning, Denise. Hey, Miss Magical Monica. Okay, then let's see. We got Febreze car. So where's that car one? I always like these Febreze car things. I'm always okay with those. These are $1.35. So this was a two-pack. And every time I get my car cleaned, I like to put these in there. And y'all know I love my car, so. That's what those look like. $1.35, no coupons. I was searching up and down to see if there was Febreze ones, but I don't think this last PNG actually had Febreze in it. Um, if it did, then I feel stupid. But other than that, I'm still pretty happy. Um, these Glade candles. Oh, did I not show the barcode for the Lysol? I'm sorry. I thought I did. But yeah, you guys can totally tell me to say, hey, show the barcode for that again. Derp -a -derp. Or if I didn't, here's the Lysol Max. And again, if you can't uh, screenshot while I'm moving here, don't worry. When this video finishes, you'll be able to go through, scrub through the video, and then um, just take your screenshots as needed. The next one I've got here is the Glade Candles. There's a lot of Glade products. And I don't know about anybody else, but I've been burning a ton of candles. I had a ton of candles. These go really fast when you let them just run all day. But I've 
since I'm at home all day, I like it to smell nice. I'm just kind of like that. But um, this was 81 cents. I paid $27 for it all, Miss Achia. $27 for everything. So that's 37 cents for each item. Yeah, hold on. Here's the Listerine Mint again. I'm kind of going by each of, uh, yep, CoverGirl Digital came right off. It worked really great, Miss Tammy. That one came off without a problem. Actually, I'll show you here, too. Oh, well, there's the manufacturer one. I had a digital, too. You can see the digital came off. There we go. Uh, next one in this one that I did, this one was a product that was five bucks. It was with everything she insisted for days anyways all last week that these would all be 70% off. This did not ring up 70% off. I just asked her about it and she went ahead and typed it in. So it doesn't hurt to ask. I only got one. I probably would have got another one for my sister-in-law or something. I've always wanted to try these jade roller things. So um, after the 70% off, it was like $1.15. But she had to manually put that in. So just FYI on this one. And that's why I only got one, because I didn't want to be greedy. <laughs> and then I did buy, like, randomly a little pom-pom pin, which I think the kid ran off with. Nope. This was not on sale. This was try to keep your kid happy <laughs> the entire time. So that's what that was. Um, you need a towel. You better go take it then. So those were those items. Um, not done yet. Don't worry. That was just the first part of my transaction. Um, the Almighty Packs. These were $1.35. I did not check for purple stuff because for the last week anyways, I've been kind of watching them and I think a lot of people bought them up already. So I didn't worry about the purple items. Um, and again, like I probably would have sat there and scanned so much more if I didn't have my little turkey butt over there with me, but I was really happy with what I got. So, but I knew this past week anyways, there wasn't really much to be had in purple at my store. Everybody else could be different, but these are $1.35. You guys know I am brand loyal to the all free and clear products. We swear by these in our household. They're great for my husband, and uh, they don't cause him any itchiness. So these were $1.35, and I, I was so sad that my all paper coupons expired last week, <laughs> so I couldn't use any on these, but I still bought them. One, two, three, four, five. Still happy with that. The Gain Flings. These... We're on sale. This particular product, uh, the Island Fresh, was on sale for $1.06. We have a $1 digital, making this six cents. My mother-in-law is going to be happy, happy, happy with this one. She's the gain user in our household. Anytime I buy gain, I pretty much give it all to her. Here's the UPC. I didn't even think I was going to going to get this. I am in Kentucky, friends. Um, Western Kentucky is where I'm at. Here's this, and this was again for the Island Fresh. I was very happy about that. Let me let my dog out because she's being a baby. So those were six cents after my uh, digital. Let, my, let me let my dog out. She's like, I gotta poop. All right, let her out. So those were dollar six. Happy about that. Um, okay, now we're getting over baby stuff. Ba the library baby, y'all know, she has more hair than any adult I know out there. Um, so this is an amazing product. I had a $2 paper coupon. That paper coupon expires tomorrow. So if you guys have any paper coupons left for Johnson's products, the $2 one, get on it. And then the $1 one, I think lasts a little longer, but I used my $2 paper coupon on this. This was a $1.08 giving me about 90 something cents in overage no we don't have many uh cases in you know the virus i don't want to say get demonetized but um i think it's because we're very country this is my area by the way you can see all the trees and things i live in a cornfield practically so we don't really have many we still have them we're still being careful we still sanitize um, and i'm going to show you talk about my sanitizer i got here in a minute too but we just try to stay careful, but not many here. We've been very blessed. So again, this was Overage. Really awesome, love Overage. And then let's see, I already told you about the Airwick Oral Warmers. 
Let's see. These, now, these rang up regular. I do want to say that. These rang up regular, and I had to ask her. I was like, look, these were on the shelf for this last week. You said they were going to be 70% off, and she took them off for me. So these were... Thank girl. Calm down. So she took the 70% off of this $7 product. And gosh, how much was that? Let me find my other receipt, because I had three different receipts here. And I apologize if I'm not moving super fast for everyone. I'm trying to. It's a lot of stuff I got today. A lot of stuff. Well, I guess take 70% off of $7. But she had to type this one in for me. So I don't know if your stores will have it in the area. But if they have it on your shelves in that spot where they're saying it's 70% off, da 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 and it doesn't ring up, just ask them. It doesn't hurt to ask. So I hopefully my sister-in-law will love these because I thought, yay, this will be great. And then this was another item I found. Another Johnson item that went 70% off. The paper coupon worked great for this as well. It came right off. <laughs> Two over there. They're being silly. So that one came off really great as well. I'm trying to find everything on here. Sorry, guys. Do, 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 do. That's what happens when I do live videos. Sometimes I take a minute trying to look through it. I'll come back to this price when I, I see it on here. But this was another overage product. I got a lot of overage on this one too. Uh, let's see. Glad storage gallon bags. Okay, let me get under here. These glad storage gallon bags here. These were... Whoop, let me drop it over here. These were 54 cents is what these cost me. 54 cents. And we're in the garden and everything. I'm sure I'll probably freeze or storage a bunch of stuff anyways. I do freeze a lot of food items here at home. Uh, so this was 54 cents without coupons. The palm olive. I'll get back to that baby one here in a second. No problem. I'm sorry. Uh, the palm olive. This was in my regular clearance aisle. This was 67 cents. 67 cents. This thing is hurting my one hand holding it. It's pretty heavy. 67 cents. Very happy about that. There was more of these there, but I just got one because I have a lot of giant Ajax stuff and all left over. Um, this baby oil cream. This is the Dollar General brand. This was 67 cents on sale. I pretty much bought all the baby stuff that I could. Honestly, I'm not going to lie. 67 cents. Uh, let's see. I got some Listerine on that. The Lysol spray. And here's my third one. Okay, let me get you the UPC code for this one again, too. And maybe I'll actually find the uh, cost of this one, too. Because the detanglers cost me... Detanglers cost a dollar eight, And with the $2 paper coupon, these were overage right here. So, let's see. Okay, so here was one, the Germex hand sanitizer. This was with everything. And it did not ring up 70% off, but again, it didn't hurt to ask, and she took the 70% off for me on this one. So this, in the end, cost me, where are you, Germex? This cost me $1.20. So, doesn't hurt to ask. Worst thing people can tell you is no. That's kind of my opinion on that. And then I got a lot of... Okay, so these were $1.35 after $7 discount, and she had to type that in. This was a penny item, by the way. Another penny item I found. I was like, hey, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I got kind of lucky on penny items. I don't know what it is with these sales sometimes. I always find penny items during these sales lately. I think it's a lot of people haven't been out and running around too, so. But this was a penny item. Went ahead and got that. Then I got a lot of masks because I love face masks. I'm ridiculous about them. I love using them all the time. Uh, this Wet n Wild mask hydrating. This was 
45 cents. I believe this was 45 cents as well. And this one was PC face mask. I think this is the PC face mask. I believe those were... Let me make sure I get the right one. I want to make sure I get the right one on here. The detox one here was 45 cents as well. Let me show you UPC codes. 45 cents. 45 cents. Mama, shut up. Girl, don't be telling me to shush. Dang. Whoa. Um, these were, I believe, 45 cents as well. You can shoot me if I'm wrong, but these were on sale too, and they actually rung up pretty cheap. So, And one last thing I almost forgot to tell you on this one. These were on sale, the kids' sunspray, for $1.12. There was more adult ones too um, in my video that I showed you guys from this past Sunday. But we have a lot of adult ones. I went ahead and bought the kid ones. And plus, notice the expiration date. So, went ahead and bought just the kids ones. And we're, we'll go ahead and use those up before anything else. Um, the men's styling. I did buy this men's styling cream for all my guys out there that like stuff. I told my husband I'd get this and he could try it out and see if he likes it. It was a dollar eight. This was a dollar eight. I was okay with that. Um, girl, and I believe this was about the same price as the Johnson Detangler, so it was about a dollar as well, a dollar eight as well. Ooh. Ooh. Can you see if there was overage with the CoverGirl coupon? Yes, Miss Tammy, there was overage with it, with the CoverGirl coupon, by like a dollar fifty. It would be like from a dollar thirty. Dollar fifty. These were like almost a dollar thirty in overage. This was almost about a dollar fifty. And I did show UPC codes for those closer to the beginning. So I'll let you guys, instead of running this super super long on you guys, um, I'll let you kind of play them back and everything um, for those as well. Or I can. I will go ahead and show it to you again. It doesn't hurt, right? What was the sticker price for the all products? Um, hold on. Uh, don't you try to open that now. <laughs> hey. You got your lip stuff. Which I hope you don't don't lose the caps for these, baby. Then you can't use them. They dry out. Um, oh, I forgot about this. Somebody mentioned in theirs, and this is really weird. This still scan up kind of funny. Um, this was like six cents or something like that. Really cheap. Because someone had mentioned, they were like, that's not scanning. The price you posted wasn't correct, da, da, da. And I was like, that's what it scanned when I was at the store Thursday. Uh, not Thursday. When did I go to the store? I believe I went like Tuesday or Monday. Monday or Tuesday I went and it scanned like full price still. Um, so, yeah, it went down super cheap. This was like 16 cents. And it's an exfoliating loofah. My husband will like those. Um, these rang up $1.35. Hey, yes. Oh, I'm glad she pointed this out because the lip product, I found lip products too. And this gave overage as well for $1.50. $1.50 in overage. I don't know how I missed this one. So if you find any CoverGirl products, guys, really. <laughs> Making them lips nice and soft. Yeah. If you find any CoverGirl products, I suggest you scan them. And if you have any paper coupons or digital coupons, you are so pretty. Make sure you grab them up and scan them because they are giving overage. Any eye products, face products, lip products. I didn't find any face products, um, but I did find eye products and everything else. Hey, no, 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 we don't sit on. Well, sure, just just sit there <laughs> in the middle of everything. Uh, but these rang up a dollar thirty-five to answer the all question. And they didn't have a sticker on them for these necessarily. Normally these are like five, six bucks. Hey, get off the table. No. Sit down on the chair, not on the table. Booty. Hey. Tables are not for your butt. She just thinks she's everything these days. Did you get diapers? No. I was so sad, Bible journaling mama. I really wanted to find diapers. I was like praying for them hardcore, but I did not see any diapers at my store. So good luck to everybody else that has them and can find them. Um, that's really awesome and I hope you can get them. Wish me luck. I'm gonna go look for diapers. I'm kind of late to DG, but here my cases of the virus went up. 
so much almost in the thousands it's scary yes please everybody be careful make sure you sanitize when you go out we sanitized when we were done um, before we went in and after we went in and we just try to stay very careful I like how they had everything out which was kind of nice for the first time because uh, normally everything's in bins and that's kind of nuts um, but everything was out nicely and they just had like uh, like a paper that was like this is 70% off and I'm like yay so it was really great hopefully this video is very helpful for you guys make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up while we're still um, here talking to each other give it a big thumbs up I always appreciate that was all of this in the clearance aisles and totes or on regular aisles okay so again no totes they're not doing totes at Dollar General right now just for the whole they didn't want to pull a bunch of hands in them so you'll have to look in your clearance aisles your in caps random places uh, because that's what happened to me. I, I was walking down an aisle and it was the most random place where it was. But they had a big paper in the spots and they were like, this is 70% off. And I was like, sweet. And then that whole area that was random to me, I found all this stuff right here. Like all this big stuff. So I was very excited about that. Oh, sorry. Wipes is, that's not anything. That's just here randomly. That's just because I have wipes. I'm sorry, Angela. I'm sorry they were up there still. Um... But yeah, I think the biggest overage ones you guys want to be looking for is Crest was an overage giver. Any CoverGirl products was an overage giver. This bad boy, I had a paper coupon for this, and this rang up for like 80 cents. And I had a up to $2 freebie paper coupon with this one. So this gave really great overage. Hey, get off the table. You are not supposed to sit on the table anyways. Thank you. Um, any CoverGirl products gave overage. Oh, Johnson products gave overage. This was a penny item. My store doesn't let me, with the same lady that I was at, she she probably wouldn't have let me use a paper coupon on penny items. Um, but those were the overage. Oh, and this was like super cheap. That was like four cents for this entire thing. Can you believe that? Four cents. This was even cheaper than the last time it went on clearance. So I can't believe it. It was really awesome. They had totes at my DG, but I live in Alabama. I don't know. They weren't doing it over here. I, and I know, like, Running Kimonos mentioned it, too, how her store was tote, no totes. They said, no totes, my goats. So, no totes for us. Everyone enjoy shopping. Enjoy your weekend. Yes. And everybody, all this whole clearance sale does last until Sunday. And then it's just done. I would suggest you try to go today, if at all possible, because it kind of gets picked off by the end. Some people are really lucky where they have stores that just, like, People don't realize how cheap this stuff is. Because I think if most people knew this was four cents right here, they'd be buying that stuff up like like candy. It's nuts. Um, so just people don't know about that sort of thing. So anywho, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, give it a thumbs up. If you have any further questions, make sure you put them in the comments down below. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that all button. That way, every time I upload, you are notified every time we go up here for awesome deals like this. Otherwise... We'll see you guys next time. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> oh. <laughs> bye. Bye. <laughs>